Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to get software for your Thrustmaster TGT2. To get software for it, simply go to a browser on your computer, then uh, go to a website uh, which is going to be support.thrustmaster.com You can see I'm on it already. Now you can go to racing and search for the TGT2. I think it's somewhere in the middle. Yeah, it's right here. Now go to drivers and find the PC drivers for feedback. Download it, then open the file. Then just click on next a few times and it'll be installed. I can't show you that right now because the program is already installed in my case, but once you open it, the program will, will install. Then you'll have your control panel installed. You can open it and your Thrustmaster TGT should show up on the list right here. If it doesn't show up, then make sure that it's properly connected to the computer. Um, you may need to use a different USB port if it doesn't work with the current USB port you connected to. And that's because the USB port uh, should be USB 3.0. Uh, I mean, I've tested it on USB 3.0 and it worked, so I don't know if it works on USB 2.0. USB 3.0 uh, has typically uh, like blue on the inside of the port, so that's how you distinguish it. Mm, now, if it still doesn't work, make sure that it's connected to the, bo uh, to the back of your computer if you're using a stationary PC. Uh, because the front ports on the computer not always work properly. So that's also worth noting. And now you should be able to find your controller here, go to properties and adjust its properties, like for example, the rotation and angle. You can see how I can change it, right? I can change it like that. I can switch it to different values. I can set the default one. I can test forces like that. And it all works. I hope that this video was helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next one.